Do you want to start drop shipping company, but you want to keep startup costs low? I'm pretty sure eBay drop shipping is already on your choices. It's hard to think about how to get started, right? Don't worry, we will help you with that. Watch this video until the end because we will solve your problem on how to get started on eBay drop shipping. Hi, welcome to Cash Baggy. In this channel, we talk about income opportunities such as side hustles, online income streams, and financial security. All in all, let's talk about money. For a good reason, online sellers frequently use eBay as their preferred marketplace. Dropshipping on eBay enables business owners to capitalize on that ready-made customer base and sell products even if they don't have physical inventory. eBay is now a general online marketplace with brand new products. Although it initially operated as an auction-based marketplace and was well-known for used goods. Since switching from selling used goods to being a dominant player in the e-commerce industry, dropshippers are not the only seller who uses eBay as a channel. Thanks to its global reach, sizable buyer base, and organic traffic, you can sell items quicker and more successfully than on most other platforms. Additionally, unlike other dropshipping strategies like launching your online store, there is no initial investment. You can start building and scaling a profitable business without spending money upfront on marketing or a domain. Are you excited to launch your business? Let's get started! Firstly, let's discuss what exactly eBay dropshipping is. Dropshipping on eBay is a fulfillment model used by entrepreneurs who buy items from a dropshipping vendor, mark up the price, and resell them on eBay. Because dropshipping has a low barrier to entry, it's a popular way to start a business with no money. You don't need to handle the items you're selling or keep inventory in your own warehouse. Order details are sent directly to your dropshipping supplier who will pick, pack, and ship the order to your eBay customer. Here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to get started. Step 1. Make an account on eBay Visit ebay.com and select Register from the menu in the top left corner to start the account creation process. You will be directed to eBay's homepage after providing your name and email address and clicking Create Account. My eBay can be found here. You can continue to set up your selling account by changing payment options, company policies, and more in your account settings and preferences. Once you've finished it, your new dropshipping store will be ready for you to begin listing products. To ensure that receiving payment won't be a problem, ensure all the information you provide is accurate. Although it's unnecessary, you could invest more by opening an eBay store. Paying listing fees is necessary though. Remember that different eBay sites exist for other countries worldwide, so be sure to sign up for the correct one depending on where your target audience resides. Step 2. Find a supplier After conducting some research, decide what you want to sell on eBay. As a retailer, you must next register with the companies that supply the products you want to sell. If you want them to drop ship to your customers, get in touch with them. A customer return label with your company name and address should be included on the package so that your customers will know it was you who sent it. This is something you should make sure the supplier is willing to do. Step 3. List the best products on eBay It's essential that you take your time with this. Remember that conducting thorough product research takes a lot of time. The more research you do, the more treasures you'll uncover. So don't be afraid to do your homework and invest the necessary time. The success of your store is ultimately greatly influenced by the items you sell. Upload professional product images from the supplier's website or, for the best results, 
Take them yourself if you have samples. To ensure your listings are as visible as possible in searches, write thorough product descriptions. Remember that you will likely compete with other sellers working with the same supplier, so you'll need to devise ways to set yourself apart from the crowd. It's also essential to pick the right price range. It must be both high enough to make a profit and low enough to compete with other listings of a similar nature. What do you think about these points so far? Please share them in the comment section below. And hey, if you are still new to our channel and love our topics, please consider subscribing so that you will be notified anytime we upload a new video. Also, give it a thumbs up as this will allow YouTube to show this video to more people. Thanks! And now let's continue. Step 4. Forward the information to the supplier if you make a sale. Every time you make a sale, get in touch with your supplier and provide them with the shipping details of your clients. According to eBay, even though your supplier is in charge of packaging and shipping the product directly to your customer, you are still in charge of making sure it arrives safely and within the time frame you specified in your listing. If you have trouble finding a wholesaler willing to dropship to your eBay customers, another option is to buy in bulk from the retailer and then send the inventory to a fulfillment service. Following that, the supplier would oversee the inventory, package the goods, and ship them on your behalf. To start dropshipping on eBay is easy, right? Do you know what the problem is? Competition. You have a lot of competitors on the site, so you have to think of something that will make you ace all of them. Here are some suggestions for you as a beginner to make your business successful. Number 1. Put customer service first. Even though the products you sell are drop shipped from suppliers, it is your responsibility to guarantee customer satisfaction. Respond to support inquiries promptly and accept full responsibility when there is a shipping or product quality issue. Number 2. Build a strong relationship with the supplier. Your supplier is a huge factor in running your business correctly. They might cancel you as a seller if you have a terrible relationship with them. Communicate with them professionally, especially if you have problems with the delivery. Issues with the product or delivery are inevitable. Just handle the supplier and the customer properly. Number 3. Create a multi-buy offer Using multi-buy promotions like one item for $20 or three for $50 will help you raise the average order value. Since there is no need to pay shipping or import fees multiple times, this can increase the profitability of your dropshipping business. Number 4. Research your product thoroughly. Research is vital when it comes to dropshipping. Select those products that are best sellers and with great profit. Be sure to compare your prices to other sellers and, if possible, offer a discount. Don't put on high prices, especially if you are a newbie in the business. This will not attract customers. Number 5. Invest in listings that are promoted. Through eBay promoted listings, you can increase customer attraction based on profit margins. These in-marketplace ads increase the likelihood that target customers will see your dropship goods. Do you think you are now ready for your eBay dropshipping business? Your research will fail if you don't take the very first step. Start it now! What do you think about this topic? Do you agree with us too? Do you want to explore eBay dropshipping? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.